What's up guys, this is your boy Rusin with another Raid Shadow Legends video. And let me just say, today is not a happy day for pretty much anybody. Actually, yesterday started being bad. Uh, and it's pretty much because, as every single YouTuber is talking about, uh, player really screwed all the players over, okay? Now, I do have to apologize, but I will have to say... Uh, I kind of told you guys, right? Uh, at least a couple of hundred people that watch my video. Um, I did say to skip this event. I knew for a fact I, I could put money on it. I could put a bat on it that Flareon was going to do something in this way. And let me explain a little bit, okay? Let me explain. My job before the military, I'm um, retired in the military, uh, I was a problem solver. And one of the reasons why I was really good at the job was I understood people, right? And I realized by a lot of things that that was something like this. I didn't know exactly it was going to be the whole uh, hammer points, but I knew something was coming up uh, and player was moving towards pretty much get people to just spend more, right? Now, this being said, um, not a lot of people are really upset because they use all their shards before. So I have some for you guys. I will tell you exactly what it will be happening very soon. So I could be wrong about the date, not really. Uh, two things are gonna happen, okay? So we have Deck of Faith coming. Uh, my belief it is that it's going to start probably on Wednesday or Tuesday next week. Why am I saying that? All right, so it doesn't matter. I can't find the news, but basically we're going to have a double, uh, double the chance to get uh, Legos from our ancient charts. So I knew this was coming for a few days. And the reason why I knew was because pretty much every single offer in the shop, not right now, but until yesterday or until that was announced, was for ancient charts. So that's how they start. So you have a chance to get every time you guys see something like this, something going to happen with ancient charts. That's all that is. Okay. Every time you guys see... They're having a sale, be 11, 20, 50, whatever amount of ancient shards. Guess what? They're going to have a double chance, two times event, something like this. Okay. Now, this being said, we know we're going to be having a summer rush, right? And we also know that Deck of Fate is going to be probably based on summoning champions. Okay. Now, Summer Rush, sure, uh, if you guys have uh, 100 shards from Champion you can pull, great. And I believe that's something you're going to have to do if you want to get the Hammer Points. Uh, Alright, uh, you can't run away from it. But I will say be very careful. And I, So you're probably wondering why I said I believe it's going to start like right away, Deck of Fate. is because the summoning event gonna give you Odin if you're first place. Now it's first out of a hundred people, so pretty much like the chances are very luck buster. Plus for you to get, usually you have a minimum amount of points, let me say 10,000. So you have to really use all your shards. Doesn't matter if you're in the easiest bracket ever, okay? You guys are gonna have to get too many points, so you're gonna have to open every single shard. That being said, Flaring will not give you time to actually get some good offers or be able to, in the most of them, tower just open, be able to get a couple of shards from there. What they're going to do is they're going to open right away Deck of Fate because then they can sell shards for whatever amount of, uh, whatever price they want. And you guys are going to be forced to. <laughs> buy if you want to try to get Freya, right? So, again, last time I gave advice, some people may have followed, some people didn't. Uh, some people actually didn't like my video for that reason. 
because I was calling out Plurium. So I'm telling you guys right now. If you guys open more shards than you need trying to go for Odin, hey, Odin seems to be a pretty good champ. But I'm telling you right now, a couple of days later, you guys are going to be having Freya popping up. So really use your shards how you feel. But my opinion is really wait until the last hour or so before you open your shards. Just in case they decide to put Deck of Faith in something they do a lot in the back end of a summoning event. So people already summon as uh, many shards just to get where they need to be. Let me say you, you open uh, 10 Ancients, 50 Ancients, 100 Ancients. Now they have Deck of Faith and you're out of any of your shards. So I'm just saying um, something to keep in mind. Uh, I was right the last time. I guarantee I'm right this time. They could wait one more week uh, in the back end, but they're probably going to do it. And the second thing I think they're probably going to do is a couple of the cards you guys flip, you may be able to get some hammer points. So I could be wrong. I really don't think I am. We, I guess we're going to find out in about a week. Anyway, guys, uh, I just thought I should come up and say that. Uh, I know I haven't had too many videos coming up, uh, but it's because I've been really busy with uh, post-production on a documentary. But I feel there are those times where I need to stop what I'm doing and, I, and actually come and talk to you guys. Kind of give a warning. Give my five cents. Uh, like I said, it's just my opinion. But I'm usually not wrong about those things. Anyway, guys, uh, if you're not subscribed, please do so. It helps a lot. Leave me a comment. Honestly, comments really help me. Uh, really help this video. You know, let some people know, let more people know what's going on. And yeah, thank you very much. I hope you guys have a great end of your day. And as always, I'll see you in the game.